How can I switch between different languages in my visualization in eCockpit? We can provide different languages for the user to select from in eCockpit. So here I've got an example visualization with different objects which have currently German text, but we also want to have them in English provided. So here we've got an example text, we've got a variable from a program and one element where we want to display the current language. Also, we've got those two buttons here, which then should select the languages. First up, we have to go to the global text list. In here, we get all the texts listed, which we are using in the visualization. By doing a right click and then add language, we can add more languages. So we want to switch between German, so I put in DE, and English, so EN. If one of the elements is being left empty, so for example these in this column, it will automatically use the default column or the default text and so we don't have to fill in the German column because those are already in German here. For the English text I will now put in the fitting translation. Make sure that you also use your placeholders, so this percent %s in your translation otherwise your variables won't work. Now that we've put the languages in, we should compile the project, otherwise we won't be able to use those languages in the visualization. Now we can already go to the visualization manager and select a language down here. This is also useful if you want to use a visualization from one of our libraries and want to place it in your language. So we can set this to English, so the visualization will start in English by default. If we now also want to give the possibility of switching the language, we just go to the visualization, select one of the buttons and on mouse click we can say change the language and then select the according language. So for the first one it is German and for the second we can change the language and select English. To show the selected language we can use an internal variable, which you can see here. It is visuelms.currentlanguage. This one I also use to display the button in a color. So if the current language is set to DE, this one will be switched to red. And if the current language is set to EN, this one will be switched to red. Now we can try it out. And we can see that the visualization starts in English, but we can also switch back to German.